Let's factor this equation here. We have x squared minus 2x minus 48, and that's going to equal 0. So we're going to factor it by finding common factors for 48, figure out this middle term here. You could also use the quadratic. You get the same answer. So let's start with these rules here. We set up our skeleton here. Now we can add the signs. Since we have a negative and a negative here, the middle term and the last term are negative, we're going to put a plus and a minus. So that'll help us out quite a bit. Let's look at the factors of 48. So these are the factors for 48. We're looking at something that has a difference of 2. So we get a negative 2 here. And it looks like 6 and 8. That would make the most sense. So since we have a negative 2, let's put 8 here and then 6 here. And we can work this out, see if we did it correctly. So we use the FOIL method. The first terms, x times x, that's x squared plus the outside, x times negative 8, that's negative 8x, inside plus 6x, and then the last 6 times negative 8 is negative 48. And if you put these two together, you combine these two, you end up with x squared minus 2x minus 48. And that's what we have up here. So we've done this part correctly. We factored x squared minus 2x minus 48 correctly. Let's find the values for x that will make this here equal 0. So we could say x plus 6 equals 0. x would equal negative 6. Here, x minus 8 equals 0. So x would equal 8. If you put negative 6 in for x here, you figure this out. All of this will equal 0. Or if you put in 8 for x, this will all equal 0. So you'll know you've done that correctly. This is Dr. B factoring the equation x squared minus 2x minus 48 equals 0. Thanks for watching.